In a world searching for gaming knowledge comes the man, the myth, a legend in his own mind, Critical. Welcome back, guys and gals. Critical here. Today I'm bringing you another episode of Subsistence on Season 5. And it is a dawning of a new day. You know, sun's coming up, new day in Subsistence. What do you think I meant? Um, and I destroyed my base, mostly. Um, what's the next piece I want to grab? I think I'm going to grab this. It needs to get repaired eventually, but I'm going to go ahead and grab this and take it down. I did work out the uh, the full distance I can go so I can get a lot done now, now that I know um, how far I can push it. And that's about as far as I can push it. And no, I'm not going to start singing. The thought was there. You're welcome that I didn't start. But the thought was there. Um, ooh. I can take this one down, but I'm going to have to replace that piece with a uh, a wood one. If I don't, I am going, you know, when you see your life flash before your eyes in this game, it can be rather scary. Um, I have to use that. Splint plus one. What? Manage yourself. Oh, split. I was like, splint? Yeah, I just used a splint, but, you know, I need one, but you can I just craft a splint? Like, no, 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 no. I have, yeah. Oh, yeah, I thought I was dead right there, and I was just going to go, okay, well, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this content. I'm dead, and I can't believe it. Goodbye, and just stop the video. <laughs> I wouldn't do that to you guys, but the thought was there because, like, are you kidding me? All right, let's grab this. And this will become my ramp. Quick. Uh, it's better than nothing. So at least I can get in and out, come up and, and do stuff around up here if I need to. Okay. So I really didn't destroy my base. I took out the top of my base though. And 40% light. 40% and I think you're going to be 42, right? And then 39. Okay, 1 percentage off. So these are a little more sensitive now up to 59. Yeah, they're a little more sensitive to the movement. The others aren't. They're not as sensitive. All right, so this part I haven't tried yet, but let's see. I don't think I can get these all the way down. You know what? I don't have to. I'll just push him down that far. And yeah, I think it's going to be another boat. I'm, I'm in the mood to build. So it's one of those things. When I get in the mood to build, it's probably best that I just not fight it and build my little heart out. This is going to be the tricky one because a lot of times I have to go down and uh, move it around. Uh... Oh, okay, cool. It clicked right in. Awesome. That made that so much. Easier. I was, that was the one piece I was really worried about getting this to click in, but pff, that works pretty good. And a little cheaty, make a cheaty. Awesome. Well, not cheaty, but it worked really, really well. All right, let's go ahead and set that. See, already having the pieces here and ready to go really makes us go a lot quicker. Um, the BCU is still going to be an issue, but I'm gonna have to figure it out. It'll take some time, I think. I don't think I'm gonna have a good answer for a while. I mean, I'll try just placing a BCU up here and hoping the re the the base starts to work, and I'll probably be doing that today. But I'm not hopeful. And remember what I was talking about the the Cylon fighter base. This is 
This is the start of my Cylon fighter base idea. At least the shape looks like a Cylon fighter. Um, for right now, put that there. You know what? Let's go ahead and remove this and set this over here. This is on the fly. I I don't know if this is going to work, but it just might. And it would give me some extra wood to use elsewhere, too. If I could utilize leftover parts from the upstairs uh, part. To fill this in completely that would really make me happy sorry about the bright sunlight just give me a second all right that does click in there perfectly oh and that does that creates a little silent okay all right i like see there it overlaps and here it doesn't but that's because i've got my watering hole and i'm gonna keep the watering hole so I'll have a, a way just to get water real quick without, you know, getting my feet actually wet. Um, how I quarter, I could do little quarter pieces to fill that in because yeah, it's, it's going to be off center. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do quarter pieces. I don't have anything on me. Let's let's go grab some. I'm gonna make at least one quarter, a quarter ceiling, so I can see if it, if my idea works. I might have what I need, just barely, and I mean just barely. I need more wood in my life. Am I right? Mm, yep, I'm right. I want to keep the sideline look if I can. Um, so this is basically my Cylon fighting position. I like that name too. I'm going to steal it. It's, it's all mine. Now I want you to click in on the, oh, that's perfect. How am I going to finish it off though? Cause I do want, so this is going to be when I'm fighting up here. I can come this way and fight here. I like having that little indent. Okay, let's go grab a few more pieces. Let's see. Ah, okay, so the thing I didn't think about is how to make this work with the upstairs part. Hmm. I mean, I know there's a way. You know, there, when there's a will, there's a way. What pieces do I have up here? Well, let me grab that and take and set it down here so I can grab it easier. I have the little winglets. Oh, they got, oh, I'll say that they almost got blown apart. I'll need one of these. And come on, click in. I like how that the wood just uh, pops through on the one side. That looks really nice. All right, click. Thank you. I like this, the, the angled glass. I want to do more of it. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it yet, but I intend to use uh, more of that. <laughs> so I landed both in the water and on the platform. I'm just going to beat myself up today. That's just, that's just where it's at. Um, for now, you'll go there. Okay, so this is the piece that I need. And I've got to figure out... Can I do this? 
No. I don't think it would provide me enough height to get in the opening. So the opening's gonna have to stay open, which is fine. Which is fine. I can deal with that. Okay, I know I already I I already figured it out. It just popped into my head. You know, I'm trying to I'm overthinking it because I'm building on camera and I want it to be interesting. I don't have to make it interesting. I have to make it work. Fighting position, I could come here and take a shot or two, come around. Yeah, that'll that'll still work. And how I fill that in is with the ex some of the extra pieces I have right here. This creates the ceiling, which which seals that off. And just for simplicity's sake, I'm just gonna take this part real quick and throw this up here. Yes, yes, that works. Let's get out in the water, take a look at it. Now, there is a problem with this design. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm seeing it right now. Anything that misses my fighting area is going to go right into my base and my glass. Um, I don't want to change again. I, I, I'm liking this right now. It's... It is what it is. I don't know what else to say or do about that, honestly. I don't think I can uh, work around it in a way that would stop that from happening. I could put a, I could, oh, I know what I could do. I would make a, uh, a second floor of defense. It would just, yeah, 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 yeah. I would just put a, uh, a second layer of, vertical on top and it would it would i don't know i guess i could have a fighting i mean i could have some stairs that go up there but the basic idea of that second layer would be to catch anything that might might hit that uh the main house it works i'm not saying it's perfect but it works the bad thing is i went and did all those foundations and already I'll just move the foundations over and I will anchor down to the ground, probably someplace in the middle. All right. Oh, chicken coop. Chicken coop. The chicken coop could be a problem. I am going to have to find another location for the chicken coop because it has to have a BCU. Well, it doesn't. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I know these can work without a BCU connected to them because as long as they've been upgraded, you don't have to have a connection to a BCU you only need a connection to the BCU to place it. And then you only need a connection to a BCU to upgrade it. For raising chickens, it doesn't matter in the least. The chickens don't care. Give me cracked corn and I don't care. I don't know why I started singing that. Um, I'll stop. Stay. Don't leave. Don't leave. I stopped singing. I won't do it again. You know what? Yeah. Per croon. No, it's not going to happen twice in one video. He was like, he's going to do it. He's going to fall. He's going he's gonna, to God, critical. You're got to fall. You have to fall for me. No, I refuse. I know he was said he's like, he's going to do it. He's going to fall. He's got, he's going to do it. He's going to fall. Yeah. Mm -mm. Wait, wait, click in. Thank you. That he, I think that's why uh, Raccoon likes to watch my uh, building videos because I always and inevitably 
fall and break my leg or fall and kill myself or fall and basically have a heart attack. Probably should have killed myself, but I got lucky and I did. And he knows what I'm talking about. The last time I was trying to build on a cliff. Um, it, oh, the bad part about these I have to move any circular walls down right now. If I don't, I'm going to I'm going to run into the problem of not having a a piece that Okay. That was not what I was trying to do. I mean, I appreciate the fact that I just healed myself. I mean, I, I was getting kind of low on health and a little bit of a bent. I need to be careful with my finger placements here. But no, if I don't have a curved wall, these things are impossible to place. I think that the their placement anchor is the curved part. So if you don't have a, uh, a curved ceiling or a curved foundation, I'm pretty sure you can't place them, period. And yes, that was somebody sneezing in my house. Hey, other people live here too. I can't, I can't stop them from sneezing. Are you a full wall or a partial, a full wall? You know, originally I was like, this is so stupid. I'm wasting all these materials making these full walls. Now I'm so happy that I did. It makes my life so much easier. All right. So any other curve, because everything else can be moved later. It doesn't have to be moved now. Does this give me a, no, I still have to jump up. Okay. I might as well go ahead and grab this piece now. I don't know what I'm going to do with it down there. Worst case scenario, it's just going to get broken up. Uh Oh, one of these is a foundation. Oh, it's the staircase. Of course it's a foundation. Got the foundational legs on it. Um, okay. Bring this back up quick. I've got a, <gasps> hey, wait a second. Get all the way down here without, ah, I can't get up there. And I know he's like, yes. Okay. So I fell, I didn't break my leg and I'm not even bleeding. It doesn't count. Okay. All right, let's try this again. Well, if I can get all the way down there with it, then this actually becomes a little bit easier. Let's push this all the way down. Aha, that does make it easier. And I was thinking about checking my uh, planters and stuff with all the stuff that I'm placing up here right now. Uh, the last thing I need to do was worry about checking it. It's all going to get messed up. See what I'm saying? This is always the hardest part. Because it, it, it clicks, but it only clicks at the proper angle. Well, that's one way to do it, I guess. Quick. You know what? I don't care if you click above or below, just as long as you click. Let me grab you real quick. And this will make my life a little bit easier. Perfect. Okay, good. I know he's, he's thinking, he's thinking, see, he was thinking it and not, uh huh. I already closed it. And as long as I don't have that, that distance to fall, I won't be, uh, hurting myself doing this. And 
to save time, I'm just going to jump off. See? It's, it's very, very particular about it. I'll click this way, and this is the only way I'm going to click. Anything else up there that I apps? Oh, there's one more curved piece. I almost forgot about it. And if I had, that would have sucked. I've had to bring uh, a piece back just because I forgot about a curved piece that I needed to move. And see, I mean, once you once you found that proper angle, they click in almost instantly. It's almost like the game is like, <laughs> yeah, it's really not that hard. I don't understand why you're having so many troubles. You just want to stick your middle finger up at the game. It's like, yeah, you can know what you can go do. So I, I, it looks like I'm one curved piece short. Well, I need to get this one down so that I have uh, pieces, places to place. Now, I think I want this to be a window. But I mean, I guess I can pop out over here to, to fire, but. Oh, actually thinking about it, standing here allows me to, to fight here without worrying about being, and that'll actually stop any round that, that would have passed through the window. Um, and that front is going to be caught by the uh, the back curved wall that doesn't have a window in it. I actually think that makes better sense too. Now, do I need a half wall or do I need a full wall to block off? Let me see. If I'm over here and I'm firing, 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 let's say from this distance, I would say a full wall would probably be the safer. It'll also protect the planters and the solar panels. So even though a half wall would protect the main living area, if I'm worried about anything that might be on the roof, I'm gonna need to protect, I'll probably need a full wall for that. And might as well go ahead and place this now. Of course, this has to get upgraded. But unfortunately, with this setup, it doesn't look so much as uh, a Cylon fighter. It looks starting to look more like a capital ship. <laughs> do I do I forego the protection and just take the the lumps occasionally that? I think for the the aesthetic of what looks like a sleek fighting position, I will uh, I'll forego that. Um, I think this is one of those times when the uh, aesthetic is more important than the function. Very very rare that I say that, but that's what I'm feeling which means I don't need you. I'm just going to go ahead and delete you and get the match back. Do I want a roof? I'm trying to think if I want a roof because it's the roof parts that are going to be the most difficult uh, part of this, this build in this area. Do I have any more curved pieces? Or do I have to, if I want to finish this up, do I have to take them? It looks like I have to take it from, this is a curved piece, I think. No, it's not. Let's, uh, such, ah, there was another curve. See, I knew there was another curved piece. Question is, do I have more than one? No, I just have the one. 
Oh, I mean, I guess I can take a piece off the main base. Temporarily. So that I, I want to get this finished today, or at least the, the majority of it finished today. Come on. There we go. Because it, ah, that's going to hurt. All right. Now, the problem with trying to do this in the water is that you're always sinking or slightly moving. There we go. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. Okay, it looks like it's going to work. And that's what I was talking about, not getting too far, not getting too cocky with the uh, placement. Take it in steps. It'll make, it'll make your life so much easier when you're trying to do, if you're ever trying to do this. Okay. We are gonna answer the main question that's on my mind about making this work. I need to get wood. Grab the circuit boards. Let's run upstairs, hit a couple trees real quick. The chicken will be fine. I'm not worried about it. Everything, the only thing that was uh, important about the upstairs part was the chicken coop and giving the the hunter something to attack and we're kind of beyond that right now i'm i am driven to uh, take care of this um i'm even going to start deleting some stuff up here to save on material and try to get as much back as possible because I'm thinking about this if I'm going to try to make this work I might need to be able to make a second VCU really quick so though it hurts me to do this I think just taking okay now I I know I can make two all right we're going to find out together if this is going to work where am I going to put the VCU down there though Let's have that at least figured out before I go too far. I mean, worst case scenario, it can go right there. Put it right up on this wall right here. All right, that's what we're end up probably doing. Uh, see, see, leg discipline. I know it's getting. Yes, yes, my uh, heart jumped into my throat. It's like you're gonna get what you want, and I'm like denied. I'm not even gonna look in it. I know I'm throwing away mass. I'm no way I'm throwing away power. Okay, as I thought, everything I heard everything shut down. This is still usable. I can still put chicken in and out. So I knew that was the case um i'm oh it turns red oh cool okay so that's that answered which i was pretty sure but that's that answered i see you moose I'm just not in the mood right now mm, you know what stick it over here so if they want to attack it they have to come around the other side all right, there's my base. All right, it is not generating power. And 
Nothing is connected. Okay, so this is connected. Why is that not generating power? Because of the other BCU, you idiot. So my other base just took over as the primary BCU. I told you I usually forget. So now I'm going to have to run to... I'm going to have to run back to the other base, dismantle that BCU, and create... Uh, come back over here. Place this one. See, that's why I wanted to be able to make two. That one will automatically become primary. Do I remove it and place it again? Or do I just leave it? I think at this point... Hmm. I don't want to delete any more wood unless... I've got enough to make a BCU. So let's go ahead and make... We've got enough to make two BCUs. Okay, we will make one BCU. I have to run over there, delete that one. That'll make this one primary. I can immediately replace the one that's over there. Because as soon as I do, that one becomes primary and it starts charging. Um, my food is going to be an issue, but I'm smart enough to... And I know my refrigerator's off, which is fine. That was the one thing that I didn't think about that I'm like, oh, well, if this happens, this is no problem. I don't need power. Yeah, I need power for my food. Turn on. Everything else is off and we're good. So there's power and I could do stuff. I just don't have a way of generating mass and or power here. So what we did answer is that if you delete a BCU and place a new BCU, everything else becomes... Um, connected again. Can I move stuff though? Yes. So before you couldn't even do that, 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 that would be an issue. Um, that's been taken care of. So we actually answered a couple questions here today. All right. I'm going to go ahead and call the episode here. I've been critical. This has been subsistence on season five. I hope you guys have enjoyed this content. If you have drop a like, consider subscribing, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Bye.